Hey everybody, Nostalgia Scott coming to you guys with part 4 of Spyro Season of Ice. So, yeah, that enemy hit us as soon as we came in. Apparently, can flame. This is Mark and Mesa. I'd say good morning, Spyro! But no morning will ever be good while those clumsy Rhinox are around. Yeah, he wants us to kill them all. It's a kill them all scenario. Yeah, don't expect me to be getting 100% when it comes to the dra uh, the fairies here, because this level is notoriously difficult. Also, I have no idea why, first of all, she hit me, and then why I didn't flame the candle. Oh, she just knocks you back. She doesn't actually hurt. Okay, I have no idea what that was. Hello, dude. I think the Rhinox stay dead, though. Yeah, the Rhinox actually stay dead. Actually, I think all enemies stay dead. Yeah, I don't think I killed you. Nope. I don't know why I didn't flame that candle to begin with. This is one of those levels where not using a D-pad might actually come to bite you in the butt, guys. Hey. Cool. Hey. Good news is at least everything stays collected, you know? Like gems and this and that. Oh, we got a fairy! It's Lauren. Oh, I just love purple dragons. Even though literally, I think there's like just one other one in existence. Oh, the bells. You actually gotta hit the bells in the right order. Which is why I'll apparently fall off a cliff and commit suicide. Kids do not commit suicide is bad. If I game over here, I do apologize. Like I said, there's something about this level that is just awful. Like, everything about it is just awful. Nobody likes it. Nobody can get 100% because they think there's a thief here. And with the charging in this game, it's near impossible to get. Oh, can, like, the fact that she, like, double, triple hits you sometimes, it's very annoying. Also, we almost got 100 gems. Also, there's very few enemies here that actually physically hurt you. Oh, and for Tails, who wanted to know if the fodder actually do anything in this game, yes, they heal you. Probably answered your question by this point already. Like, on actual YouTube, but, you know, just uh, a note that I actually do read comments. A lot of time I, re I record two to three episodes in a row. Uh, why my uploading's been off is because of my girlfriend's work schedule. Uh, plus, I've been playing a lot of World of Warcraft, which requires internet. But lately, I've been doing trades on my character, so it doesn't really matter if I have good internet or not, as long as I can go to the auction house and buy shenanigans. Okay, not shenanigans. Supplies. Can't use shenanigans for everything, you know? I will admit the music is kind of just peaceful here, but the level itself is not peaceful. Nope. Oh good, I needed to come down this way. Good thing I fell down this way, man. Oh, you had to fall down that way. That's the only way to get there. My kitties are uh, acting all adorable. And why didn't she actually hit me that time? You guys notice that? That she wasn't able to hit me there? She's able to hit me in almost every other spot. Whoa. Oh, I did get the gem. I'm like, did, did, did I not get the gem? Also, more enemies. Also, I'm pretty sure it's over here that's the chest. Also, my kitten is up on the uh, table. Mr. Ned. He's, uh, he's a cute little white cat. With a very long orange tail. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Yo, dude, you don't need to, like, keep talking to us every time, you know? Oh, there we go. Might as well get this, just in case we die. It almost launched all the gems overboard, and he's trying to drink my Fanta. Orange Pop. Orange Fanta. I know they have a lot more flavors in America than just orange grape and cream soda, but I do love the grape. Though, just nowhere ever has cans of it. He's, hang on a sec, he's, he's all over the table. Yeah, get down there, buddy. Thank you. Oh, God, I should not have made that, but I did. Oh god, that was that was way too good to be true. I'm also excited to go to the bookstore one of these days. 
Oh yeah, that's the thief we stole. I actually did it before. I actually managed to do it. Out of pure fluke, too, because the chances of surviving here, like, see, the hitbox is so big on those. And I believe you actually have to charge them, which, like, if you could just flame them, it, it wouldn't be so bad. But the fact that you literally have to charge them is stupid. Like, you can't charge, see? You can't charge over ledges in this. Mm-hmm. You know what? No. I am not going to give myself a heart attack trying to deal with them. I will complete everything and everything else in this level, just not that. Whoa, I got hit there. Trying to kill him. Wait, where does Brethren go? Well, actually, I won't get the bells done in this episode. I do want to try and do Mermaid Coast in this episode as well. I do apologize for that really short episode. Like, an 8-minute episode is not that good. Like, it doesn't even get the YouTube notifications. Oh, man. Oh, wait a minute. I still gotta go back to the bell to get the candle anyway. Oh, man. My little kitten's back again, though. He's, uh, just chilling down by my legs. He likes quartz. Oh, yeah, I actually need some health this time. Man. Can't even, like, see sparks in the butterfly half the time. Wait, no, this isn't the one with the bridge. Never mind. I'll have to come back for that one. Also, pretty sure that was a ledge. Actually, might not have been. Don't honestly think it was. Oh my god. The fact that you get stuck on literally everything in this game is kind of annoying. Whoa. Oh god, I thought she knocked me off. Wait, that was all the Rhinox. Thank you, Sprout. It's going to be much easier to get some work done without those Rhinox around. And left behind a crystal thingy. Where is it? And Alice from Wonderland. I don't even know where we are. Where are we? Oh my god, we're all the way back here. Seriously, game. Why do you keep putting us back in the exact same spots? Like The fact that that's all the Rhinox is kind of interesting. That means there's no more enemies. I thought they meant the soldier Rhinox, not the female ones, but... Okay, we almost got all the gems as well. Maybe we only need 17 more. Thanks for the rescue, Spire. I swear we already had Liz, but... I guess that's just me. Good news is if we die, the only thing we have to go back is for the candles, but that's kind of why I'm trying not to die. Why did I slow right down there for a second? Yeah, this is just the action figure. Yeah, I'm not gonna grab that. See, I, I hit the wall without even hitting the wall. Like, See, your charge is just so awful in this game. We gotta find that pathway and go back. Oh my lord. This game is good, but it's painfully annoying at some points. Uh, apparently my girlfriend can't figure out where she messed up last night at work. Wait. Oh my god, you can't fall off these. Oh my lord. That is, that is good to know. I'll message her back after this episode. I told her I was going to record today. And I told her it's hard to record while she's messaging me, so... Yeah. Anyways, let's see if we can find out where to go. What's that over there? Oh, that's just a, an island in the sky. Hmm. Hmm. The fact that now we have to get all the candles again ticks me off. Oh, I made it, surprisingly. Oh, and that's all the gems. So, yeah. Let's leave. I just pretty much did that for that. No one likes this. I'll come back and get 100% later. 
but it's annoying. So we got another 300. Yay! So, in the next episode, what we will be doing is we'll, we will be doing Mermaid Coast. So if you guys are excited for that episode, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys all next time when we go for a swim. Well, not really a swim, because guess what? There are no actual underwater levels. Bye-bye!